Drew here from BackcountrySkiingCanada.com. We're skiing in the Whitewater Backcountry today and uh, checking out the Silo 30 pack from Arcteryx. Um, so far so good. Just let me run through a couple of features. They've got this little little hip hip uh, hip band here that uh, has smaller smaller things than initially I thought it wouldn't be comfortable enough, but it's fine. It fits perfectly right on the hips. Standard sternum strap right here. And let me just show you some of the features that are in the pack itself. Um, first of all, they've got the great, uh, great thing here. Can you see that? For things like hats and goggles and, and stuff like that. So that's just a pocket on the top of the pack. And then we zip open to the main butt. Well, first of all, there's another pocket here, which supposedly is for a shovel, but my shovel is too big. So, I mean, with every pack, you're going to be able to figure out what you want to do with it. But here I put my skins in here or a lunch or whatever because my shovel doesn't fit. Let's open her up, see what we can see. It's a lovely uh, clamshell design, so it's easy to get into. You can look at all my stuff here, see? <laughs> and uh, what else we got? So I've got my shovel in here. So shovel goes in here. There's a cool little pocket here where I have a down jacket and other clothes that I want to keep dry. That might be where some people want to put their put their shovel also, but I've kind of reversed it because the shovel fits really nicely right in there like that. Um, so they got a probe sleeve, a shovel sleeve like that, but we tried the ski attachments on a little bit of a boot pack that we did on the way up here. These are these things. I usually go with the A-frame, but this time I did it the diagonal and these work really well. They're super solid. So all in all, so far so good for the uh, Arcteric Silo 30 pack. I love it. I'm going to continue to use it. And uh, yeah, as I say, I've figured out some some things that I do with uh, particular pockets and you can probably figure out uh, things that you want to do too. So that's that. Thanks for uh, listening. If you want to uh, see about any other great gear that we might review or read, uh, read some trip reports, whatever, check it out on backcountryskiingcanada.com. Sayonara.